Hello and welcome to this week's um, painting demonstration. I'm going to be painting in, in acrylics today and it'll be of a little Herdwick sheep which I absolutely love. Um, if you go on if you go to, on holiday to the Lake District you will find the Herdwick sheep <laughs> and they are so cute but anyway so I'm just uh, going to twizzle this around and uh, we'll see what's going on. So this is my setup for today. I have my reference image on the left. I can get you a link to that. It is a paid reference. Um, but uh, yeah, so, and it's a fantastic site actually um, to get any wildlife reference from. So please have a look and, uh, and uh, get some references for yourselves. And um, so what I've done already is I've primed this 10 by 12 inch canvas board um, and I've primed it with some Mars black and some ultramarine blue and I've just got it on there so that because to me the background needed to be like that because the sheep the, sh the background of the sheep or the skin of the sheep is kind of a bluey black to me and so this is um I'm using a tin foil um, to put all my acrylics on, so it's a nice way of getting cleaned up afterwards. I have raw umber, I have ultramarine blue, sap green, yellow ochre, some titanium white, and some cadmium red hue. And obviously, you know, whatever brands and whatever colours you've got, um, use. And the the paint brushes that I'm using, um, this is. A, it's a bit scruffy, <laughs> cheapy brush. It's around. Um, that's my biggest one, I suppose. I've got a little filbert. Um, I've got a little strip liner. I've got a rake brush, which is really handy. I don't know whether you can see that. Maybe not. Um, really handy for your fur and things. And for any details, I've got a little teeny tiny brush. I think it's a arms master all media series 10 so yeah we'll see we might not use all those but um i'm going to use as usual um this pastel um pencil just to mark out where i need to be so let's pop you on the doodah gobbinsy is it the oh, I, don't, I can't remember what it's called right so let's find the top of the head. Let's find the jaw. This can all be moved about if it's not quite right. I think the first eye is going to be here and the second eye is going to be there or thereabouts. And the head comes around here. I think is going to be that about there. A little bit of a smile. <laughs> I think it might be a little bit longer than that. We shall see. 